Good morning, soul family. I'm going to have to make this message short and sweet because Mother Gaia is lightly misting on us as we speak. I have been enjoying the bounty of her gifts this morning. I have taken a walk in a residential area. Believe me, I live in a neighborhood, but there are blackberries and mulberries all ripening right now as we speak. And I wanted to share with you my bounty. I wanted to share with you a berry breakfast this morning. And what I've been meditating on is the so so there are multi multi-dimensional understandings, realities, experiences to this human life that we lead. And what has been shut down currently is one dimension of the human experience that we've all created for ourselves, right? I'm going to call this the secondary human experience. There are primary human experiences that we have been shutting off, um, maybe avoiding, or maybe we just weren't even consciously aware that they even existed because for so, for a couple of generations now, we've been kind of uh, removed from them, from things like picking berries, from this bounty of wealth that is made available to us by Mother Gaia. And we haven't even been aware that it exists. I did not know blackberries were growing all around my house during a certain season. What else is there for us to discover, soul family? There is so much, there are so many stones left unturned here. And I want you to talk with Mother Gaia. I want you to go out in maybe even just the little bit of nature available to you. Maybe it's a simple tuft of grass. You can connect with her there. You can even connect with her through concrete. Believe it or not, concrete is made of the remnants of Mother Earth. And there are, there are conduits of communication made available to you there as well. The, the closer to nature that you can get, the more that you are going to discover. But we, that, that's actually a part of the message, soul family, that we, we need to look at that which we have that we have not been, been aware of for a very long time. And if we are sitting in our house, surrounded by the news and focusing on what it is that we don't have anymore, we're missing out on an entirely new show that's in town, okay? I, I guarantee you that we are missing out if that is how we are using our time during this shutdown. And I know a lot of things are actually about to open back up in the world and in many ways, that's a good thing. I'm not saying it's not. I'm, what I'm saying is before that happens, if you have not taken this opportunity to connect with your Earth Mother, with my Earth Mother, with the Earth Mother that makes siblings of us all, then you're missing a golden opportunity here. That's what I'm saying. I'm going to refer to a recent video posted by someone that I truly respect and who helped lead me on my own path of spiritual discovery. Abby Normal has a new video out and I'll put, post it in the comments. And what I took away from this message of hers is that we have to start doing the things that we would never do. How are we ever going to grow? How are we ever going to actualize, to realize, 
to manifest all of these things that we do not have if we continue down the same path of discovery it's not even discovery anymore it's it's a path we've we've already traveled it's we know all of the twists and turns we are creatures of habit and we do need a, an amount of routine to establish order in our everyday world however there is a breaking free of that order that is warranted if you are desiring a new experience and how are we ever going to grow how are we ever going to know anything new if we don't kind of deviate outside of the normal boundaries of which we have traveled in order to discover the berries that await us hmm this was a beautiful message and I know that it's hard and I know that it's scary to travel the path that we've never taken but this is the point at which we access our heart as the compass and we need to sit and we need to you can call it meditate sometimes I call it marinate because I'm also a cook and the the conceptual process of marination it takes a while for those flavors to seep into those ingredients to permeate through the dish in which you are creating and if you rush that process it's not going to come out tasting the same we are dishes in the making for the world to enjoy and I don't mean that in a literal sense. I obviously it's we are we are all masterpieces waiting to be painted so that the entire world can marvel at our beauty. And sometimes though we get stuck in the same old stroke and it's you know maybe it's a beautiful stroke and it doesn't mean that that stroke needs to be you know eradicated taken out of the painting at all what it means is that accompanying strokes need to be added to the scene okay and if you haven't looked at any of I mean if you haven't seen Abby Normal, you need to look into also her paintings. Um, I'm not sure how much of that she's put on YouTube, but you can feel the emanating energy from the different entities and angels that she is accessing in the spirit world that she is able to actually capture within the painting. And it's it's absolutely incredible that's her conduit of expression we all have one and we we need to start accessing it via the paths we have not traveled either for a while perhaps it's a path we used to travel as a child and that is a message that is coming through also soul family it is so important to have fun right now because fun is the entryway for the beauty to unfold within all of us that is the access point that is the portal losing ourselves in the joy with our family with our loved ones with people that we might have looked at as you know an inconvenience on our time before all of this happened and now there are bit there are bubblings within you in which you are realizing that there is so much here that you've been missing there is an entire grotto that's been hidden and now is your time to explore that okay so this light language transmission is to alleviate the fear and open up the portal of the heart as a compass for you to explore and access that joy that exists within you. Undi 
dare wai e kainai te saino e a kainai te a dare wai hai ho nei tahi ai karawe a nai saino e tai e to e to e to e ai tahi ai nai tu ro a e ai kainai tu e ai se ai no kai tai ro a e mai tai ai e mai tai e o e sai energy and feel your heart portal expand you into an entirely new untapped universe of what you have to offer this world. My name is Jenna Pinkstone. I hope that you will further connect with me on Instagram, on Facebook. Come and share with me the joys that you are uncovering, the grottos within you that you are exploring. Come to my Facebook group, and also i hope that you'll join me on facebook live every saturday at 8 p.m central where i provide free readings if you would like to connect with me for a personal reading and soul energy update you can call it a soul journey i will explore the depths and grottos within you in which to uncover everything that you i i feel that you would benefit from exploring because I enjoy exploring all of those nooks and crannies of the human spirit and it is it is a joy it is a it is an honor to, for that to be the gift that I bestow on this earth and I want to help you discover yours so thank you again and I will leave those links for Abby Normal in the comments page